What's up, challengers? Welcome to the gym. My name is Gym Leader Geo, and this is episode 13 of our Alpha Sapphire Let's Play. In the last episode, we explored Cycling Road. We did a little bit of Mauville City. And in today's episode, we're going to finish off Mauville City. And we're going to take on the gym. And um, I think <laughs> we'll see. Maybe I'll, I'll fail. So uh, you haven't missed anything. I just decided to cycle all the way back to town rather than have that uh, montage -y thing there. And then I grabbed, there's an X speed over here and I just, I grabbed that. Um, so we're going to go, uh, we're going to do this, this cafe that we walked by earlier. We're going to fight some guys in here, I think. Um, this little kid with some spectacles says, hey trainer. This is your first time here, right? This food court is a bit strange, so there are some rules you have to follow before you eat. I come here all the time, so I can tell you about them. Number one, place your order at the counter. There are three items on the menu there, so order whatever you'd like. When you are done ordering, the restaurant staff will give you a buzzer. Number two, sit in a chair while you wait for your food. It may take a while for your order to be ready. Have a sit and wait. Here's the important part. While you're sitting and waiting for your food, others will come and battle you for your seat. You have to fight back if you want to eat the meal you ordered. Number three, eat your food. When the buzzer goes off, it means your order is ready and can be picked up at the counter. All that's left to do is sit back and eat. What do you think? Easy, right? Well, you've come all the way here, so why don't you order something? Since it's your first time here, maybe you should try the village sub combo. The restaurant is a chain from Minova that just opened up here. It's easy to eat, so it's pretty popular with kids who like single battles. All right then, see you later. Enjoy your time at the Mauville Food Court. He was just leaving or something. Uh, do I have to wait in line or I'll just talk to this girl, I think. Yeah, I'll try. Yeah, all right, I'll spend 1,000. Um, place an order. Please take your buzzer. Your meal will be ready in five turns. Okay. I feel like I should have healed up my Pokemon or changed my lead. Hey, stay away from that chair. I saw it first. This kid is trying to steal my food from me. He's got... Youngster Cutler has a Slugma. Hmm... Am I still leading with Miguel? Yeah, I am. And I think he's paralyzed. Is he paralyzed? No, he's just basically dead. You know what? I'm going to take a, take advantage of this opportunity to heal up, actually. Because while I'm confident that I'll do a lot of damage with Water Gun, I might not one-hit KO. And I just want to make sure that... Yeah, he's going to go for the Incinerate trying to burn my berry. It's kind of a jerky move. Uh, but my I do not have an Orin Berry anymore. So I'm going to hit him with a Water Gun. And, okay, so it would have killed him. So maybe I didn't need to use that soda pop, but who cares? It was free. I got that for free. So, I got a six-pack back in the day. PK grows to 13 and wants to... PK Spark? Oh, boy, this is just too good. PK Spark. Let's get rid of... Uh, I'm going to say let's get rid of... Howl is just attack stat? Yeah, we, we don't need you to have Howl. You are a special attacker. You're a special boy. Good boy, PK. PK Spark. Excellent. So, I, um... I hurt Cutter. Mm -hmm. Oh, you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to, um... Move my Luck Incense onto my lead Pokemon. Well, I lost. There's nothing I can do but look for another chair somewhere. There's plenty of chairs in here, aren't there? Here, check the buzzer. Just three turns until your meal is ready. Oh! Five turns, that's right. Uh, okay, so let's one-shot this dude also, if possible. Uh, I'm challenged by school kid Mitzel, and she sends out an Oddish. I'm not sure I can one-shot an Oddish. Truth be told, I'm not sure. Miguel's level 26. I really don't think I can do it. Um, tackle is probably my best move here. I'll just hit him with a tackle. And yeah, it's going to be a two-hit KO, which means I'm only going to get three battles, assuming I land with this uh, land this tackle right now. 95% accuracy. Okay, so Otis goes down. Looks like I'll get one more battle in, and then I'll get to eat my delicious, delicious food, it looks like. School Kid Nitzel goes down. 340. Phone is literally blowing up, actually exploding. If you lose, you can't sit down to eat. The world of food is really harsh. Yeah, but it doesn't. It seems like it doesn't need to be. Uh, you guys are bringing, you're self-imposing these rules. 
No matter what, that chair is mine. If you don't get up, I'll force you to get up. Why are these kids so rude? You live in a world of Pokemon. Everything is beautiful and fantastic. And you guys are running around. Making all this noise. I'm gonna throw rocks at you and you're not gonna like it. Goodbye, Taylor. Goodbye. <laughs> Taylor goes down. In five turns, Miguel leveled up. Uh, in five turns, I get to eat my meal now. Um, Chill grew to level 23. He wants to learn Slash. That's a pretty good move, I think. Cut is 50 power, 95 accuracy, but I can't get rid of it. Obvi. Uh, this is 70 power. Yeah, we're gonna get rid of we're gonna get rid of Encore because I really just don't see myself using it. It's just not my deal. What can I say? So I defeat his name is Ham. <laughs> Youngster Ham. Goes hard. What level are you? 27 now? Alright, Miguel. Do it then. Fine. I and mean, I can't leave him unevolved forever, just waiting for him to learn moves. And, and realistically, the only good physical water moves anyway are Aqua Tail and Waterfall. And he's not going to get... I don't think he gets Aqua Tail at all. And I'm not going to get Waterfall for a while, so I might as well evolve him. Might as well. Might as well. Too bad. I wanted to sit in that chair. You could just wait like a minute, dude. I'm like, try I'm about to get my food. My buzzer's going off. Your buzzer is buzzing. Time to get your food. Alright. Alright. So sorry to keep you waiting. Here's your village sub combo. Huh. It's ready and fresh from the oven. Well, thank you. Just when everything is most delicious. This is free of charge, so please feel free to t It's not free of charge. You charged me a thousand. Oh, the nugget. You're going to give me a nugget. Okay. Now I chomp down on this elegant platter. It heals up my Pokemon, I think. I recycle. I recycle it. Blue is recycling. And uh, I'm out of here. I am what you would call an Audi 5000. I'm going to hop on my bike. Come up here. Alright, what have we not done? These two got two little places here. What is this? It's got like a little Pokemon thing. I can't see the sign. Battle Institute? Hmm. Alright, let's see what you got in here. Hello. Howdy there, trainer. Please wait. You're a skilled trainer, ain't ya? No need to say nothing. Just take this here gift. VS recorder, cool. So this is a... Yeah, yeah, we all know what this is, guy. We've played Pokemon X. So this is... I don't need to do battle... I don't need to do a battle training right now. So that's what that is. What is this, then? Because this is like, it looks the exact same, but it's in black instead of white. Why can't I... This is so difficult. Same old battles. Got you down. Turn it up with inverse battle stop. Uh, no... I'm not feeling inverse battles right now. So let's go in here. This is the, uh... This is the Pokemon Center. Uh, do I need to heal up my Pokemon? Nope, everyone's all healed up and raring to go. This guy looks like an ace trainer. Hi, were you surprised by the size of Marvel Center? I really was, actually. After all, it's the biggest city in Hoenn. Yeah, it's pretty big. O powers? Did she just say O powers? So there's O powers in this game. Someone in here has an O power. My name is Giddy. I have a scintillating story for you. Would you like to hear my story? Are you going to give me something? Alright, I'll I'll play your game, Giddy. When you see the setting sun, does it make you not does it make you want to go home? Yeah. Also, I was thinking, what's the bottom of the sea like? Just once, I would so love to go. Yes, I would also, I guess. Also, I was thinking, I bought crayons with 120 colors. Don't you think that's nice? Yes, that's fine. Thank you for listening. To show my appreciation, I'll share my... There you go. There you go. I figured. Someone was just talking about it. So you can use speed power level 1. That's interesting. I'm not going to do that. They're super useful. Use them on your friends, too. 
I never leveled up the uh, speed or attack stat ones. I only ever leveled up, you know, like hatching power and money and stuff. Okay, so let's keep going here. Um, we've done, that's like the mirror place where I, I need the Therian. We've got a dude standing here. He used to run a business here. I had to close it for reasons. Anyway, I still have some prizes left. Do you think you can take care of them? Uh, yes. Dolls? A Torchic doll? Ah, oh, and then a little Mudkip doll. Okay, so this guy gives me dolls from a secret base, which we don't know about yet. What have we here? A cafe. I'll go into a cafe. It, the diagonal view makes this really hard to move around. So what's going on in here? He works for an academy in the city, and he wants some... He'd like to teach a move to Keldeo or Meloetta. I'd like a Keldeo or a Meloetta. This person likes music and stuff. Um, hi, welcome to the cafe. Stong songs change with time. Time change with the songs. I wonder what kind of melody is popular now. Relic song, perhaps? Oh, round. Yeah, okay. So I got a TM. I'm not going to... I'm not going to use it. I'm not going to talk to you guys either. There's only ever one thing in any given building, so I figure I'm out of here. So, now what? I, 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 I don't know. We talked to you already, I'm pretty sure. Did we talk to this bikist? I think so. There's an elevator here. I don't need the elevator. There's a gym. Boom, and there's Wally chatting with his uncle. Uncle, I'm begging you. I want to challenge this gym to see how much stronger I've become. Please, you'll let me, won't you? Now hold on, Wally. It's certainly true that you've grown quite a lot stronger alongside your Pokemon, but don't think jumping right into challenging a gym might be pushing it. I'm not pushing it. If it's me and my Ralts, we can beat anyone. Ah, Geo! Ralts and I have gotten a lot stronger since we first met. Growing together, I want to prove to you that... And my uncle both, Geo. Please... Help me once more. Have a battle with me. Yes. Thank you, Geo. Okay, here we go. Damn it, I forgot to move the luck incense. I'm just going to put that on every single... I'm going to buy nine of them and just litter all the Pokemon in my boxes and trainer party. All you've got is a Ralts and you wanted to take on a gym? I don't know, buddy. Level 17 Ralts and you wanted to take on this gym. Look how big Miguel is now. Marshawn is going to tackle you with the full force. Oh, and he barely lives and he goes for teleport. Dude, you... There is no way you were going to beat this gym. There was... There was no way. The mosquitoes were really biting. And there was no way. Poor Wally. Wow, you really are strong, Geo. That's what my mom tells me. I should have switched and gotten double that money. Look how sad he is, though. Uncle, I'll go back to Verdant Turf. Geo, thank you. Being a trainer is tough, isn't it? It's not enough just to battle with your Pokemon. I can't become a true trainer like that. Not really. Wally, there's no need to get so down on yourself. Why, what's keeping you from becoming stronger? Nothing is. All you need to do is keep growing. Come on, let's go home. Everyone's waiting for you. Yes, Uncle. Geo. Bow. I, I'm definitely, I'm going to get stronger. Much, much stronger. I feel like I learned a lot from just one Pokemon battle with you. By my own limits. And Ralts. So, um, that's why, Geo, if it's alright, could I, could I call you my r rud? Ah, never mind. Sorry. It was nothing. Please forget about it. G goodbye Oh Wally You cute little guy Trying to get all battly with me It just dawned on me That you must be the young man Who kept an eye out for Wally When he caught his Pokemon So it's you we have to thank For Wally becoming so positive about the future Thank you Ah here take this I want you to have it It's a bit of a thank you Rock smash Dude now we can go back to uh, Now we can go back to the trick house which we might do we might do but probably not in this episode if you ever have the time I'd love it if you stop by our home in Verdant Turf I'm sure Wally would enjoy it too we'll look forward to seeing you alright uncle uncle Wally 
Eva. Let's hop on into this battle um, and let's move around some stuff. So this looks to be very electric-y. What do you have to say, buddy? Yo, how's it going, champ to be Geo? Watson, the leader of, of Marvel Gym, uses electric-type Pokemon. If you challenge him with water-type Pokemon, he'll zap him. Bzzzt. And he's put in switch-controlled electric devices all over his gym. Ex Did you say eccentric or electric? I kind of clicked A too quickly. Hey, go for it! Okay, so let's do this. Let's have, uh... Let's have Matang kind of just smash his way through this gym. Because he's level 23. Pretty much every Pokemon on my team is 22 to 24. And I think Matang can, uh, I think he can handle some business here. So I'm going to fight this dude. Oh, he's like a rocker. Guitarist Kirk. Wow. Shredding, bro. Every... Every voice I do just somehow eventually turns into sounding like, uh, like a surfer. Magnemites here. Ugh. More Magnemites. Let's go for a Zen head, but I don't miss, luckily. Uh, I don't kill him in one hit. That's a crit. He's going to go for the Thunder Wave. Okay, it's one of these. We're playing this game, are we? I'm going to finish this guy off with an Iron Head. Hopefully this guy doesn't use a Super Potion right now. He does not. He tackles me. Does one damage exactly. I hit him with an Iron Head and Magnemite goes down. Beautiful. Even though it's not very effective. Hank grows to 25. Hank is kind of beast in it right now. He has an Electric. I'm going to keep battling. I want PK to get stronger. Even though PK probably could have taken on that Electric. T-B-P-H. We're going to go for a Zen Head, but he's going to go for an Odor Sleuth just to make sure he can hit me with normal type attacks. I land the Zen Head, but I don't get fully parried. Electric goes down in one hit, and boom, we are golden. Moving on up. I want to get rid of this Paralysis. I wonder if I have a Berry for it. What Berry cures Paralysis? Do you guys know? Does anyone just like have that information just memorized, like what every single berry does? I know some. Like important berries, I know about them. Cherry! Boom. Uh, so there's a switch here. I stand on it, and it moves that. Yeah, oh, okay. It's like a little, it's like a really easy puzzle. Do you guys remember Lieutenant Surge's gym? Way back in the day, that gym was the most annoying thing I've ever seen. So, Youngster Joey's gonna be here. This gym's got puzzles. Okay. Youngster Ben. Sends out an Electric. We've already established that you cannot withstand the full force of a Zen headbutt. That's... Which is a weird thing if you think about it. Let's think about Zen headbutts right now. Like... So centered. So centered. And then you just like... Slam. Slam to the jam someone with you. <laughs> Hit him! That was easy. PK grows to level 14. <laughs> my my uh, monitor. I guess I haven't been moving my mouse enough recently. Which tells me I haven't been drawing on the screen enough, guys. If I'm not drawing on the screen, what, what are you guys even here? Honestly? Honestly, if I'm not drawing on the screen... No, no, no. I'm happy to be here. This is a really easy puzzle. It's an unfortunately easy puzzle. We've got a battle girl in here. With my charm and my Pokemon's moves, you'll be shocked. You're going to kick me in the face. Yeah, look at that. Talk to the boot. Boot to the head. Yeah, this isn't an electric-type Pokemon, dude. What are you doing in this gym? You scare me a little bit, Metatite. You do just... Just a smidgenly bit. Scare me. Um, I'm going to hit you with an Iron Head. Not a Zen Head, but because we've already established that that's just neutral. So, might as well just hit you with the Guaranteed Accuracy. That's why. He's got a Thunder Punch. Hit him with a Thunder Punch. Good. He didn't use a Potion. I'm glad no one's been using Potions. I don't have any, like, ground-type attacks since I got rid of Mud Shot. But that's only a 20 power attack. That doesn't even count. Even after super effective hit, it's just like 40 power. That's nothing. So, this is pretty much the easiest. What do you, you don't want to fight? 
Oh, I see. I would have had to fight him after I hit the switch and it goes up and down like that instead of side to side. So, guitarist Sean. Sean. I know the name Sean spelled S-E-A-N mostly, but I guess that also looked like I typed Sean. Hmm. Yes. Voltorb. Taken. Oh, no. This isn't very effective. Shoot. Oh, I flinched him. Excellent. <laughs> Let's hit him with another one. I am thirsty. He gets me with the static. Son of a gun. I wish I had Earthquake on this guy. Earthquake is a great move. We're going to keep battling. Matang is, instead of using Iron Head, going to use Zen Head. But if I had Earthquake right now, I would get rid of Iron Defense. I land the Zen Headbutt. This should kill you. Yes. Eggs have been loaned to me. Eggs are lent. Eggs are lent. And we get 900 cash Poke Yen money. And uh, now we're free to just waltz on up to the gym leader right here. So let's give a Cherry Berry to my dude. Use that on Matang. The screens, I feel like, are kind of weird in the menu. And then let's save together. And uh, let's take on this dude right now. Let's take him on, take him down a peg. He's just wasting, that's just wasting electricity, honestly. We're talking about, like, in, in Slateport, we were talking about, you know, hurting Pokemon environment. You don't think the emissions this guy he's just he literally just has electricity just burning off for no reason let's see what we can get here oh now what are you doing here what you said you've gotten past all my rigged doors <laughs> now that's amusing the plans to reform Marvel are done for now making traps for my gym and battling with young trainers like you are the things I live for now then I Watson the leader of Marvel gyms shall electrify you <laughs> he didn't actually say ha 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 he was just like silent laughing like that's what he was doing look at him look at Watson that's that all right buddy you and me both right that's how I smile and every episode like that, I guess. I should do that. Uh, Matang's going out against his Magnemite. Mm, Magnemite. I hate you. Let's hit him with a Zen Headbutt. I don't know why. They're both resisted. I should have gone for the 100% accuracy one. I should have done that. He goes for a Thunder Wave. Ah, now he's just going to start Sonic Booming me. Yeah, let's go for an Iron Head here. Oh, no, that's four times resisted. Oh, luckily you used Volt Switch. Oh, cool. Volt Switch. So, maybe it'll only be kind of resisted. It's a Volt Orb. Uh, I'm fully parried anyways. Blah, blah. I do not want Matang to die, but I think I can get one more Zen Headbutt off. He's going to go for Volt Switch. Bring in that Magnemite. I want that thing gone. I want that thing dead. Dead and gone, dead and gone. Magnemite, yes. Oh no, he's not gonna die from this, is he? Iggy, Azalea, ah, it's a crit! Yes! <laughs> Take that, Magnemite. Now I get a chance to free switch. Voltorb's coming in, then I think... Let's have Chill. Let's have Chill come into the fray right now. Hmm. Stepping up to the plate, Voltorb gets switched in. And I'm going to slash this fool. 70 power, normal stab, silk, scarf, Voltorb goes down. That wasn't even a crit, high crit ratio. High crit ratio just means like 15% or something. Like, instead of, it's like 6 goes to 12 or something like that. I don't know. Broloom levels up. Magneton? Oh boy. Let's keep Chill in here for now. I can't believe that's a Magneton. This is scary. We're going to go for a faint attack here. Um, 
That's gonna be like a four hit KO. He's gonna go for supersonic. Ugh. Ugh. I mean, I suppose it's better than. Uh, I don't know. I'm gonna go for slash and see if that does any more. Don't hit yourself in confusion. Mother. <laughs> Volt switch. Where are you going? Okay, that is an incredible amount of damage. I am not... What can I do, though? I'm not willing to lose chill right now. I mean, I could just... Use a soda pop. I didn't... I'm gonna use a soda pop here. I didn't measure to see how much damage that did, but... I need to see whether or not it's a two-hit KO from max health. So he's at, I'm at 74 now. He uses Volt Switch again. And uh, 37, I'm pretty sure that's exactly half of that, right? So it's become 6, 14, 7, 3, yep, 37. So it is a two-hit KO. Son of a gun. What can I do? I can't... This, this guy is just mopping the floor with my team. I'm going to send in... Oh, my goodness. Um, I'm going to send in Miguel, because he'll probably die to this. But like I said, I will not dump Miguel, even if he dies. So this is my free switch opportunity. He's going to go for the Volt switch. It doesn't... Oh, I'm ground type now. I forgot I'm not pure water. No, I did that on purpose. I predicted the electric type attack, and I switched in, and now I'm going to hit him with a water gun, because the only thing I have that'll hit neutral on this guy. Does pretty good damage. He's going to go for the supersonic. Of course he's going for the supersonic. Wally, is this the kind of shenanigans? I bet you ladder on, I bet you ladder on poke battles or, 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 uh, or showdown with, with these confuse race like shenanigans and stuff but luckily miguel does dom his face chill gains a huge amount of experience pk grows to 15 and watson not wally duh i just fought wally fine i lost five thousand that's why ladies and gentlemen that's why you buy <gasps> brayloom wants to evolve unfortunately buddy i need you to get spore and brayloom does not learn spore only shroomish learns spore so i need to wait for you to get spore before i level you up i was electrified by you oh wait no no sorry no. <clears throat> i was electrified by you now take this badge i'm old kind of a cool badge Dynamo. With Dynamo Badge, Pokemon can use the HM Rock Smash outside of battle. One of the things. Pokemon up to level 40 will be now, even if you got them to someone else. Alrighty then, this here's for you too. Go on, take it with you. Volt Switch. Wow, that's awesome. That is cool. I'm going to teach that to uh, to my dude. Volt Switch is... Yeah, we all know what Volt Switch is, guys. Come on. Come on. And that's going to be it for this episode, guys. We explored Mauville, we took on Wally, we took on the gym, and we are here now with three badges doming up this circuit right now. So thank you guys so much for watching. Leave me a thumbs up or a comment in the comment section down below. Let me know what you thought of this series or this episode in general. As always, my name is Gym Leader Geo. You guys are the challengers. Thanks for stopping by, and I'll see you guys next time.